what's the worst trip you ever had? The worst trip I ever had, bro. Fucking Orlando. I Fuck. was actually dying. Like, <laughs> so I took one tab and I was like, oh, I feel good. I'm, I'm in the bath and shit. I got like these purple lights on. I feel like I'm in the ocean, like in, in the midnight sky. It's purple. Like, I'm having a good time. I'm like, you know what? I'll take another one. <laughs> I took another one. And all of a sudden, I'm in my bed and I'm on my phone and the TV's on. And I start noticing that every time I swallow, like, you know, usually you swallow saliva sometimes. Every time I swallow, I'm like swallowing. <laughs> oh, I know, I know. Every time I'm swallowing, like, I'm done, bro. It's, it's like, it's like oh, I'm swallowing a decibel of my hearing. Damn. So, Damn. Yeah, so I swallow, I lose a decibel of hearing again and again. And then I notice, like, wait. My TV volume was just my TV volume was just on. I should I don't hear nothing anymore. I can't hear oh, nothing shit. anymore. So Helen Kelly. Yeah, okay. then I start like feeling my fuck. This shit Helen getting Kelly. Hyped, Helen right? R. Kelly. I start feeling my heartbeat and like that shit is going fast as fuck. And then I start feeling like my internal organs is failing on me. Okay. And so to OD. I, shit. Yeah, yeah. So I get up. I'm like maybe like just like the lights. Like I need a brighter light. I turn the closet light on because my room lights were purple. And like I'm standing on the door, like I'm like I'm leaning over, like fuck, like you need to calm down, bro. Just calm down, just calm down. And then like I, I, I like calm down for a second. Then I got in the bed. I had stopped saying you need to calm down, but I kept hearing that shit like in the distance. It was like it kept like creeping up. I'm like you need to calm down. It started bouncing off my walls. Like you need to calm down. You need to calm down. You need to calm down. And like my bed started fucking <laughs> swirling around. <laughs> this, bro. And then I'm like, fuck, I need to wake up. I need I need help. Like, I'm dying. I'm dying for real. Like, so I wake up my stepmom. And my stepmom was about to give birth the next day. And I'm coming I'm like, hey, like, you can't freak out. Like, you can't freak out. Because if you do, I'm going to have a heart attack. Please, like, d please don't freak out. She's like, all right, all right what's wrong? I'm like, so I took something. And she's like, oh, hey, my God, just lay on the bed. And so I'm laying on the bed, and she's checking my my pulse. She she won't let me see it because I like she don't want me to freak my own self out. Pregnant as fuck. Yeah, pregnant as fuck. And then I'm looking at her, and her eyes are like this big, but they're all black, and they're like quaking like this. Oh, fuck that. And her mouth is like <laughs> this little, and she's like speaking to me. I could barely like understand what she was saying. And then uh, I don't know. I found out later my heart rate was like 180 beats per minute. 200 is a heart Damn. attack. So, but I remember going into the restroom and like looking at my shirt. I remember this so vividly. I went to go take a piss and it was like rainbows coming out my dick. <laughs> oh, <right? laughs> that was cool. And then like my, my I had a shirt. Down. It was like maroon, gray, and white. And like there was like moss. When I looked in the mirror, there was like moss growing on my shirt with like hieroglyphic in encryptions on my shirt. Like I was wearing a plate of armor or some shit. And I was like, God damn, like, I'm <laughs> fucked, I'm <laughs> fucked, yeah, like yeah. To and so ever since that day, like, I definitely fucked myself. Cause that shit wasn't real, that shit wasn't real acid. That shit was research chemicals, they're called M-bombs. They literally just fuck your brain, they fry your brain. So now like I'm permafried. Like I still like, I'm pretty much stuck in a constant Acid trip. So you're on an acid trip right now. I mean, like, it's I don't know because I'm so used to it. But like, there's times where like the other day I woke up and it felt like my fingers were like strands of hair. Oh <laughs> shit! I was okay. thinking this nigga like, living in astro world and shit. Yeah, like, yeah, and I have to. I like my doctors wanted to put me on medication and shit, but like I really just learned to deal with it. Like that shit is like normal to me now, you know. But yeah, I encourage everybody to stay away from psychedelics. Oh, Hey, where do you get that from? What? <laughs> the shit you was tripping on. RC? Yeah. Get that shit five dollars on the street. No fucking way. Oh god. Five dollars yeah. to go to Astro Fuck yeah. Yeah, I, that's why I used to buy so many. They were so cheap. I just buy like twenty tabs. Like, and yo, who wants to take these? The first money? one you ever took fucked you up like this, or it was like the No, tip? the first like twenty trips I had were like amazing. I was <laughs> like, I, I was on top of the world the first time. And then I think like once you once you get so high you hit the ceiling and you go all the way down to hell like i don't know bro like it was weird it that was a weird time in my life and if i could change anything it would be to go back and never take that shit 
But yeah, that shit was crazy. That was the worst trip I ever had. It wouldn't sure be to not take, take the like, film. Anti-psychotic drugs. Oh, probably would bounce that now. Nah, they tried to give me that shit. That shit just made me numb. Mm. Like what? being that numb. Antidepressants is, make you numb. Not nah, all that I shit. I literally take them. Nah, all that shit makes me numb. I just, I just stay away from drugs now. And it ruined weed for me too. Cause I used yeah, to smoke know. on it. And then like, so now when I smoke, if I take one hit, bro, I'm tweaking, bro. I'm That's tweaking. I'm you tweaking. Fucked I'm fucked. You fucked up right now. Nah, I'm not fucked up right now. <laughs> I'm, I'm good right now. Bro. So you don't drink or smoke no more? I, I, I drink sometimes, but I had to stop because that shit makes it worse. Were you better at making beats when you was like fried? Nah, I used to try and make beats on acid and like. <laughs> <laughs> so you wasn't even doing this for creative reasons. You was just fucking. I, I was just tripping. Yeah, I just had. I, bro, and I don't know how I did that shit. I used to take acid and go on dinner, go to dinner with my parents and like oh, wow. talk to my parents. Like I was so in control of it. And then like I just lost it. I lost the control of it. I don't know. Shit. If you like this clip and want to see more of the unfiltered, unedited version, of the Suburban Boys, click that link in the bio so you can help support your favorite creators and help us live our dreams as full-time creators. Thank you.